Hey guys, got a new deck profile for you here. This is Constellers. Uh, I've been playing it now since Hidden Arsenal came out. Uh, I've been working on the build and stuff. I still haven't got Sombras and only one Omega right now. But uh, I'm going to get Sombras pretty soon, I hope. But uh, right now, this is what I've been working with. Uh, start off, we got two Sheraton. He's your Stratos for the deck. Summon him. Normal summon him. Add a Constellar from deck to hand. Only run two because three was just getting too cloggy really. Like I'd draw it whenever I really didn't need it at all. Because the biggest problem it being a level three. Uh, and it's attack only 700. So only two of those. Uh, next. Triple Pollux. Normal summon him. Get another normal summon of a Constellar monster. Word for word, same as Caster, Evil Swarm Caster. Run three of them. Triple Kaos. Uh He's your closest reference would be Wind Up Shark twice per turn. You can, uh, yeah, twice per turn, you can either decrease or increase a level of a Constellar monster by one, making him your Exceed engine. You can go from three, fours, or fives. With him, you, if you get two, you can even go for sixes. Uh, I don't run any of the bigger Constellar guys like the level five or sixes, so basically this deck goes, this version of the deck goes three, four, to five. Uh, the next triple Algidy will probably take out one of these whenever I get Sombras. Just keep two. I like having these Constellars just because it you can go for fours if you only get Pollux and Algidy. If you get if you open Pollux, Algidy, and Kos, you can make Shockmaster plays. You can go so it's like really good. It's exceed Swarm deck. Uh, that's it for the Constellar Monsters. Next I have two Thrashers. Just you know first turn you can get up your exceed if you don't open that great. Like if you get these and one more monster you can go for at least a rank four play. Uh, unless you open Sheraton and Thrasher, but you'll get a search anyway. Uh, next, two DD Warrior Lady. Uh, she's only in here because, like, I'll probably take these out whenever I get Sombras. So we'll take out one Algidy and the Warrior Ladies for Sombras. Uh, but she's in here because she's a light. She can be honest, can be used with her, and she's a warrior. If I happen to draw Naroda and just need to get her, so she's good. Uh, one honest, of course, it's a light deck. And final monster, Brotherhood of the Fire Fist Bear. Uh, for spells, got Rhoda and Triple Tinky for searches. You search out Koss and Bear with these. Uh, one pot of average, you go through a lot of monsters in this deck. So, you just recycle your exceeds and make more plays. Uh, two Forbidden Lance, protect your guys. Of course, double MST, Heavy Storm, Dark Hole Reborn, your staples for the deck. Uh, for traps, two Compulse, two Fiendish Chain, two Bottomless, two Torrential, two Mirror Force, and one Starlight Road. Uh, yeah, the decks. It works really good now, except I know it works a lot better with Sombras, which I'm going to get soon. Uh, but now for the extra deck. One Zen Main's the only level 3, or rank 3, that I use. I don't use the Constellar one, it's not really that great. I tried it once and it just didn't work out. But the only uh, rank 3 I got right now is Zen Main's. Like, I hardly ever, ever need to go into it. Uh, for 4's, Abyss Dweller. Maystroke, Starleash Paladamo, Constellar Beehive, one Omega, I only have one at the moment, like I said, we'll be getting another one soon, one Gym Knight Pearl, one Shockmaster, 
And for the rank fives, I have Volcasaurus, Zenmayo, Triple Pallades, and then one M7, and to end it, one Stardust for the Starlight Road. But that is the deck. It's been testing fairly well, and I've done, I've had pretty good success with locals with it. I like the toughest matchup I've had so far is Dark Road, because really, all Pallades does is bounce Dark Road's back to hand, and which isn't really that great and not an optimal play to do. But the deck overall is really good. It'll be a lot better when I get the new stuff. Uh, but uh, thanks for watching, guys. And like, subscribe, comment, anything. You know, feedback is always welcome. And we will see you later.